Yo, what is good, you guys? Your boy Jasu, and today we're here with another video. Today we are actually here with something new with CJ the Champ. I've actually seen a couple of this guy's videos, and they're hilarious. So I was like, you know what? Once he, once he uploads next, I'm gonna react to it. Why not? You know what I'm saying? For you guys and for my enjoyment as well. So, what we have here today is Sakuna is a dog. The most disrespectful moments in anime history, part five. If y'all don't know who Sakuna is, man, prove me. Y'all gotta watch Jujutsu Kaisen if y'all haven't already. Sakuna is a Sakuna literally is a dog, man. This man is OP as shit. For like, it makes no sense. He's watched literally everybody, and I can't wait to see what he has to say too. So, if you guys like this video before we begin, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you are new for more reactions like this. But I further do. Let's hop right into it. He brings this man to the fight. So then he says, all right, my boy, class is in session. Today we will be learning how to beat an ass 101. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, but mm -hmm. he will be used as a demonstration today. I beg your pardon? Ba that's basically literally what happened. Two seconds, middle of the fight, just left, brought him back. Say, hey, watch this fight real quick. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time for another installment of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. The series that we observe some of the most outrageous, most outrageous yep. oh, moments to ever be seen by the human. That, that show that just make you look something. at the screen like, well, goddamn, what did they do to make them oh, is that mad? Damn, damn. So, without further Shit. ado, roll them. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, first up to the plate is Sukuna being a dog. So mm -hmm. Itadori and Fushiguro are fighting this ugly ass boy. What the f is that? Jesus Christ, bro. That is just ugly. So Itadori tells Fushiguro, all right, listen, bro. I'm just going to have to let that doll come out. So Sukuna mm -hmm. comes out and he's like, hey, what's good with you, cuz? So the curse bags up and he's like, ah, oh, hell no. Nah. <laughs> Who is this thug ass? Nigga? So then he starts talking to him like, boy, I tell you, boy, you ugly as shit. The f you supposed to be a fish? Man, this fight was hilarious. I'm not so even gonna lie. he jumps back and starts charging up. Is that a Hadouken? So Brad shoots it, but he just stops. That we should out of here. That we should out of here. Then he looks at him and says, You ugly lip motherfucker. <laughs> Boy, I ought to beat mm. your ass. So mm. Brad just face mm. got a thong on the ground. Then he starts looking at him like, Damn, cuz the fade just started and your ass already on the ground. Nigga, you best get your mm. fucking ass up. Yo, dog stepped on him. So then he tries to grab him, but he rips his arm off. Who said, damn, boy, that gorilla gripped him back uh. on your ass. And yo, he is laughing while he is doing this. Yo, this man is a demon. So later on, while he is continuing to torment this thing, the curse comes down and starts laughing at him. So then he starts looking at him like, why you got that big ass grin on your face? You think shit is sweet or something? Right. Goof ass, boy, I'll show you what's sweet. So then he hits she him showed with him the, the pieces. domain expansion. That was actually pretty clean, too. Oh, boy, turned this man into a fish fillet cooked well done. So then he says, all right, little nigga, you can come back out now. Hello, can you hear me, nigga? But then he gets no response, so he's like, huh. demon time. So about You're a a demon later, time. he pops up right behind Fushi Girl. So he's like, what's good, cuz? Just to let you know, I'm about to beat your ass. But before I beat For your no ass, reason either. I'm going to eat this crusty ass finger. Go. The flavors are melting on my tongue. Wish I had a little bit of salt on the door. I ain't gonna lie to you, my boy. Now, time to beat your ass. Oh yeah, I did it. Starts... He had to take out this dude's heart for no reason. Like, just to make sure he don't come back. And if he does come back, oh well. That's it, man. That was it, that was just not needed, but so disrespectful. That's why you gotta love him. Weaving, but look at this man. He is weaving <laughs> all of his punches. Sidestep game is hard right pockets. now. Oh, nah, bro. That's how you know you're done when the nigga don't even want to take his hands out. So he keeps on punching, so Sukuna's like, mm. damn, boy, you can't hear shit. Come on now, put your back into it. Ooh. Oh, boy, backhand. the backhand of the century. So Fushi Girl trying everything. He trying to jump him with the snake, the owl. He just Gotta bring out Mother Nature on this man. He just God. like... So then he comes back shit. down, grabs him, and he says, come on now, there's a whole world out there we got to see, nigga. Yo, bro, check his whole body. That is, that a whole you should be mad, honestly, after that. Then bro starts playing ping pong with him. Boom. 
Bro said, come on now, get your story. <laughs> Y'all, so, right. so as this man is flying, this man's spine should have been like, dust. Comes in and picks him up. You're he dust. right behind him and he like, boy, that ugly ass knocked out. Set your ass down. Mm, down smash. Good God, that beating didn't even make any sense. He just beat this man for just for absolutely no reason at all. <laughs> yes, he's a God, dog. This man is disgusting. Yeah, when the rest of this manga gets animated, Homeboy is most definitely getting a full video. Yes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, next up on the list is Gojo's PowerPoint presentation. So while bro is on the way to go meet the principal, he tells the driver, yo, stop the car. Oh, so yeah. No, oh, this way. He says, all right, you could come out now. So then this ugly ass boy come from the top rope. Then dog said, What's this, good? Is, this is literally the most disrespectful fight. So he start throwing out I've everything. Ever bro seen. Some fat ass Hands down. At him. He came from the side and made he him said, ghost rider. And then he decided to hit him with a gut check. So then after all that, bro is squeaky clean. He has taken no damage at all. So Volcano Head like, huh? Uh -huh. What type of hacks you got? So then Gojo's like, you come realize. Here. Come you here. cannot hit me, right? Come so here. then he says, come here, don't touch be shy. Me. Come a little closer, touch my hand. So he tries to touch his hand, but he can't. So I was like, huh? The f is this? You're so not even. Like, you feel that? This is called my infinity, AKA my plot armor. So do you want to know what you Stupid are, Stupid plot armor too. You're fodder. <laughs> Good God, bro, got check the life out of this man. Then dog said, hold on, I ain't even done yet. <laughs> <laughs> Then he says, oh, you really thought you was going to sneak me and get away with it? <laughs> get out of my face. Oh, shoot. Ah! Oh, my God. Such Dog's a disrespect. Been flying, and look at him. He's dragging that the down. Such a oh, so so mm. Look at him. He's dragging his dirty ass through the ground. Then he tries to hit him with a gallic gun. Then he comes from behind and he's like, well, if you don't sit your goofy Ooh. ass down. Oh my god, bro is gone. I think that's the most disrespectful like, oh, part. This is a perfect time. So this man leaves, goes and sees Itadori, and he's like, yo, do you want to watch me beat this nigga's ass? Huh? So he brings this man to the f And that all happened in a matter of like six seconds. Back and forth. Grabbed this man in the middle of the fight. I've never seen such disrespect. Fight. So then he Never. says, all right, my boy, class is in session. Today, we will be learning how to beat a nigga's ass 101. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, but he will be used as a demonstration today. I beg your pardon? So then Dog's like, you mother Hey, stop playing with my name, nigga. But then Gojo's like, <laughs> your name, but you are weak. You're Yo, I'm more. <laughs> I bet you half of the people that watch this show don't even know your name. <laughs> to be honest with y'all, I don't even remember his name either. I, hold on, hold on. Let's look him up real quick. Isn't it so? Kano head in JJK. Jugo? Jogo? Jugo? Basically, yeah, Gojo. Go Jugo. Gojo. All I know is he looked different. like Squidward when he had the volcano on his head. But anyways, bro got pissed. He was like, stop playing with my name. So then he uses his domain expansion, and he done turned this bitch into Bowser's castle. So then Gojo's like, all right, Yuji, pay close attention. So bro takes off the blindfold. Look at this is a beautiful the man. Expansion. Look at that beautiful, beautiful face. So bro's like, Ugh, what is this? What it's like to chew but five gum. Beautiful ass nigga. But then Gojo comes behind him and he's like, you know, man, it sucks being ugly. Trust me, I get it. Well, actually, I don't, don't. get it. <laughs> I don't get God, it. beautiful. But uh, let me put you out of your misery. <laughs> Man got fatality and Bro, still he just live. Ripped his head off with one hand, and to add to the disrespect, he stomped on his head like dog, the soccer the with your head. He basically used this man as a punching bag to be an example after he just tried to sneak him and he left mid fight. <laughs> Bro, that's disgusting. Uh, our next moment is more JJK. This actually would have been a Jujutsu Kaisen special if the last one wasn't JJK. But anyways, right. Toto beating the absolute breaks oh. off of Fushiguro. Now you see this moment. I love Toto, man. Disrespectful. Nah, this is also Toto is literally hands down one of my favorite characters. Horrendously moments to yes, ever like, exist. So Toto if it'll and be, Mai pull up and they talking match. It'll be Gojo and Toto. Classmate died. Tell and me, Sukuna. how hard did that pack hit? 
So then Toto walks up to Fushi Girl and he says, hey boy, what's your type? Depending on the answer that you give me will determine if I beat the shit out of you or not. What? Imagine. Imagine Bro, you just you have that about, much power. Dude, you just do this has to be one of the most wildest things I've ever heard come out of somebody's mouth. This is determined to run this man's fade if he does not like the exact same girls that he likes. So then he's like, come on now, speak up. How you like him, nigga? I like him tall with a fat yeah. ass, boy. Come on now, I ain't waiting all day. So he's like, I, right, uh, as long as she has good character, she's a 10. Ooh, ooh, tomato, tomato. So then Toto's like, damn, bro, you got bad taste. Huh? So he blesses this man, good God, the clothesline from hell. Then he walks up to him and says, I knew it. Just by first Look at that body, like, look you a bitch body. ass nigga. So Fushi Girl pulls out these frogs, but bro flash steps and takes them to Suplex City. <laughs> so then he starts pummeling them. He's like, fight back. Yeah, I realize that Fushi Girl gets beat the shit the most out of season one. Like, the most disrespectful like, whooping on, is boy, him. I ain't done yet. He starts lifting this man up through the entire building. Good. God. He should be dead Yo, from just all these fights. So I'm like, just come saying. on now, fight back, little boy. So as he's about to hit him again, Toge has to come and hit him with the shit your out. ass up, boy. Chill out. Then Panda come in and he like, yo, what are y'all doing? Then Toto says, his taste is trash. Let me beat his ass. But he's like, ah, forget it. But next time I see your bitch ass, your taste better change, boy. Yo, the fact that this man Toto almost beat this opera. man Fushi Girl to death because his taste in woman is bad. Like, uh, what? I'm just saying, bro. Basically, yeah, the power to do that. I is trash to the. Extreme. I was the same as that thing as, uh, as I, soon I, I said it. At a loss for words. Yeah, <laughs> right, <laughs> gentlemen. Our final moment, probably if not one of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. Perfect Cell violating Vegeta. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, oh, uh, uh, no disrespect no to Vegeta. But no respect. First him. of all, these two buffoon ass niggas. Let's start off with this cocky bastard. That Saiyan Pride really had to kick in in full gear, huh? Bro, really let this man go absorb 18. And he was attacking Trunks, the only person with common sense during this entire moment. You yeah, still gotta no, love Vegeta, bro. man. You deserve to get He's an idiot with pride. Too. Oh, and at least. don't think I forgot about this bald bastard. You had one job. This man was a whole simp. One little smooch. One little puck on the cheek, and you was whipped hey, into bad, some cyborg coochie. He tried, at least. Said, the earth, she bad as hell. Man, oh man, did these decisions come to bite y'all in the ass. So yes, after Cell absorbed 18 and became perfect, bro is just glorified by himself. Man, like, he's on damn, I'm be level beautiful. 100. And look at oh, Vegeta, dumbass. Oh, wow, give me a mirror. looks less intimidating. I thought we already learned this lesson with Frieza. When they look less intimidating, they're strong as f so then Krillin goes in and attacks this man. And bro ain't even paying him any attention. Man's is like, wow, 18 really had feminine hands. Then Trucks came in and started attacking him. And he is still paying them no attention at all. Then he ate the Destructo disc. Then he turns around and he's like, so you want to play little nigga? I then witness perfection. Look at him, he's skipping to him. Then he gets up in his face and he's like, boo. Then boo, boo nigga. breaks his neck. And he is out cold. And look at him, he's like, uh, weak ass nigga. 16, you wanna do something? Yeah, I'm good. Right. Stay your big ass right I'm here. good, so you got here it. Here comes Vegeta. So he's like, all right, I see you got that perfect jawline and everything now. So you ready to scrap? Then Cell says, uh, I guess you'll be a decent warm up. So Vegeta just starts throwing everything, but bro is just blocking it. Bro's like, my, my, my prince, you're gonna have to do a little more than that to make me try now. So then Vegeta hits him with this kick and he's like, yeah. I did that. <laughs> so I was just looking at him like, really? Trash ass boy. So Vegeta's like, huh? What is this? And Cell's just laughing at him like, <laughs> uh, you better die now. That corny ass name called Super Vegeta. Now let me show you how to throw a kick. So he kicked the <gasps> life out of this man. Look at him. He's good. Good. And look at his and arm was just taking all that rock to so just bing, starts bing. talking. He's like, wow, you was talking all that good shit a second ago. Now look at your sorry ass. So Pick then in your chest. Vegeta does personally my favorite attack in anime. He starts charging up the final flash. And Cell is just standing there watching him do it. Bro's looking at him like, man, you're putting on a great light show, buddy. This rival's Disney World's fireworks show. 
So then Vegeta just starts calling to him. Sell you bitch ass, fuck ass nigga. If you think you hot, then stay your ass. Final right flash there. is a good move. So Sell's like, lie. I oblige. So then Vegeta hits him with the final flash. Look at me like, oh my god. Oh shit. Look at that attack. You can't tell me that attack ain't beautiful. Still to this day, I wonder. What poor planet did that blast end up landing on? So everybody's like, oh Sector my god, seven. he's done it! Father's done it! So he blew off half of Cell's chest. So Cell says, ugh, he actually hit me, damn it! So Vegeta's like, yes, I did it! I am him! So while Vegeta keeps uh, on laughing, <laughs> Cell says, stop laughing, damn it! No, no, bro, stop that. laughing. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, bro. It's just a look on his face that gets me every time. So it says, did you forget that I had Piccolo cells as well, you dummy? So then Vegeta just losing it. He just starts spamming Keyblast. But we all know. Oh, that when works. Vegeta resorts to using this spam Keyblast move. It's He's over. done. So He's Cell done. just walks through it and just slaps him. So he kicks him to high heaven and hits him with the spike. Ooh. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> man, just eating pavement, eating floor. Sad life, man. Well, that was the most disrespectful moments in anime history five. Basically a JJK special with a little DBZ dab in there. I will have a poll on my Twitter and my IG later to see if y'all want homie right here we on the are, table. Ooh. I can either add him now or wait till the next art gets animated, which I've already read, by the way. So we'll I bet decide you did. that. I bet you did. But, uh, hope I'm going to wait. Make I'm sure going to wait for that. Channel. Follow you on IG and Twitter, and uh, I am out of here. Ugh. Such disrespectfulness from. It's about that they keep dogging Vegeta like that, like, and it's sad because like he never gets no shine. Even with that like new rage thing that I saw, like randomly like rage Vegeta, that he just basically he's basically like a a brute that doesn't really care about damage. Even with um how um that um death battle they had that in there too, that didn't do shit. It didn't do anything. So it's like, bruh. <laughs> The amount of disrespect Vegeta gets is crazy. But Jujutsu Kaisen fights now. Gojo just leaving a fight. Imagine, imagine you in a fight, getting your ass handed to. They leave and say, hold on, I'm gonna go get me a snack real quick. Eating the snack, finishes it, and it continues to whoop your ass. At that point, you might as well just leave. You might just just, just go home. I, like, I would not come back. I, I would have just, yeah, your whole career done at that point. <laughs> Anyway, this is a great video, man. I gotta start watching more of these, man. So if you guys have any make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you are new, share the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.